Hey guys, it's Bianca from Plan Love and Budget. How are you today? I have happy mail. So this is a different type of happy mail. This is for my planner stuff. And look, I have a cute little pumpkin sticker. We're gonna rip through it. My invoice is in here, so that's why I was covering that up. But this is from Savannah Paper Co, AKA my twinsie, AKA Karina, who owns it. Super excited. So, I've been really, really good. Part of my budget, I was using the stickers that I already had, so I wasn't buying any planner stickers starting since January or February of this year. So this is my first time buying sticker kits since then. And it's only because I love Halloween, you guys. I love fall, I love October, I love Halloween. So I had to pick up her, she was having a Halloween sale so I picked up some Halloween kits. So we're gonna get into it. Here are her journaling cards, protect your peace. Yes, 100%. I love that she gave me both of them. So those are probably gonna be able to hold punch and I'll put them in my binder. So right now they're gonna be, one's gonna be right there. Here is a freebie. This is Clarence, if you guys don't know. He's the mascot, he is so cute. Here's some doodles, freebie doodles. And then I picked up two of the spiderweb date dots. Um, mostly because I have two different planners. I have my daily planner and then I have my memory spread. So that's why there's two. Her kits do include the date dots. It's just, I like, you know, for Halloween, come on, we gotta be festive. Some of them might have, whatchamacallit, um, festive ones for the date dots, but Anywho, we're gonna zoom in so you guys can get close. I'm gonna move those so no peeking. Anywho, this is the first kit is Dark Knight. I got this for my birthday, hey. So this is actually gonna be used in December, but I had to get it. It was also part of the Halloween one, maybe because you could dress up as Batman. I don't know, but I appreciate it because I am definitely going to use it. So there is the boxes, glitter headers, and date dots. See, these are the regular date dots, what I was talking about. So for the Halloween kits, I am happy that I picked those up, but this one is probably gonna use the regular date dots because I'm not using it for Halloween. But there is Dark Knight, kit number one. Kit number two is, make sure I grab all of it, Scary Movie Kit. I love this one, this is, um, Last year, she created this art and she just reformatted it. If that's a word, reformat it. Not reformatted it, you know what I mean? But I love the details on these boxes. Oh my gosh, I love how she designs her kits, it's so pretty. Yes, even this is pretty, but yes. Oh, I love it. And I think last year I bought red foil that was all like Halloween themed and bloody and all that kind of stuff. I went all out. I don't know if I'm gonna buy extra foil because I do have a lot of foil. So I might not, but I do have red foil to go with that kit. So next up is really, really cool. This is a true crime kit. I am a true crime junkie. I love my true crime podcasts. Normally I listen to them every single weekend. In fact, I missed this past weekend because today's Monday, um, we were out of town and I was visiting with some friends. So I need to catch up on my true crime, but I think it's like the mental health behind it that really fascinates me on like why people do what they do. But anyways, I think this is gonna be perfect for Halloween for sure. I mean, the colors are definitely Halloween, but there it is. Love it, love it. Okay, next up is one of my favorite movies, the one, the only, Hocus Pocus. Oh my gosh, I love Hocus Pocus. We watch it every year. I love it more than Halloween Town or any other Halloween movie. This is my ride and die Halloween movie. Now, The Nightmare Before Christmas, I do watch on Halloween, but it's also my Christmas movie, so I actually watch that on Christmas Eve as well. But as far as like a true Halloween movie, is Hocus Pocus. You guys will have to let me know down in the comments below. Did you like Hocus Pocus 2? 
let me know. I feel like that's kind of like a hit or miss with some people. I didn't mind it. I thought it was cute. It's just not, I don't know if I'll watch it every year like I do the original, but it's fine. Next is Cookie Kit. Cookie Kit. We're a little bit kooky. Anyways, I love The Addams Family. I also enjoyed the Wednesday um, Netflix series that they came out with. You guys will have to let me know if you guys liked the Netflix series. I was actually like really surprised at first when it was like teenage kind of thing. Oh, I got two of them. Twinsy, did you send me two? Okay, I'll take it. So I have another kit. <laughs> so there's the second one. It's the same exact thing that I just did. I might have ordered two. I have no idea. Maybe. I don't know. Who knows? I get shop happy. Zombina. Zombina kit. I love the colors. So if you want something that's not traditional Halloween, like the black and the orange, like, or red that I have just shown you guys, I love this kit. There is some orange in here, but I love the pastel colors. It's so pretty zombie themed you know i i prefer vampires don't get me wrong but i do love the the zombie theme in here and the patterns it's really cool very very pretty so again see like just regular date dots which is fine i'm glad she includes them in the kit but i'm also really excited about the spider web ones they're gonna look really really good so there's zombina zombina <laughs> Again, I have two planners, you guys. So I have two more kits to show you. <laughs> and it's because one's going to be in my daily and the other one's going to be in my memory spread. So that's like eight weeks worth of Halloween stuff. So anyways, so here we have alternative boxes. And here are the full boxes. This is Spooky Night Kit. Love it. Again, a little bit more traditional with the colors, but at the same time, also not traditional like I like how it's done I love this I don't even know what color that is like <laughs> it's not a mustard it's a muted green almost like a lime green I think it's showing true to color on the on my phone so I don't know I just love it so cool and also um, her kit so I got all of these as full kits um, she does have mini kits and you can also customize your kits as well. So you can pick and choose which sheets that you want. So she does have options. This is Ghosts with the Most kit. And you know what theme this is? Yes, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. This is another movie I like. I'm not, I don't really watch it as much as like um, Hocus Pocus as in like every single year. But I feel like, because I don't think I own this movie, but I do feel like if it's on one of the streaming shows, I do watch it. I like horror movies and scary movies. Vince doesn't. So we do have a list of Halloween movies that Vince will watch with me. And then ones I watch by myself. <laughs> you guys will have to let me know if you're in the same situation. It's not a bad situation. I could still watch my stuff. I just have to do it on my own but yes these are all the kits oh my gosh I'm super excited to play with them to have them organized in my I have like a little binder I'll show you guys my kits where I keep my kits for the week it's right here so these are the kit lineups that I already have and then leading this is all September and then leading into October we have the new Wednesday kit and then that will be replaced because that's not in October, but yes. So, and again, foil. Yes, I have a lot of foil. Looking forward to pairing my foil with all these too. So that is everything I got from Savannah Paper Co. I will have her link down below. And yes, so let's get into today's video. All right, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed that happy mail, but let's get started with today's video because Oh my gosh, it's going to be long. But oh well, it is what it is. So, I have the money here. I went ahead and divided it up. This is my original one that I was supposed to use. Um, well, I took to the bank and I divided up the money. So, here we have it. We have the A6 
and the big in here here is for this booklet so let's let's just get started and ew who put the money like this i did i did okay here we go and i also have the calculator next to me just because i need help but 51 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. For 2. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. For 3. 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 51, 52, 57. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys. All right. So let's get started. I have a, like a lot of tens. All right. So, and then we'll do this. Actually, we'll just do this right now. So then I can go ahead and put the money in here. I have $50 going in for Christmas. I don't need this sticky note. Oh my gosh, you guys. All right. So 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. Whew. Okay. You know what? We're just going to do this because I feel like we might need smaller denominations. So I think I'm just going to take the 50 and we're going to put it towards this. So we're starting in June, I guess. I don't know. What was, what month are we in? August. Yeah, since I just switched it out and I only have the 50, let's just go ahead and start in June. It's fine. So we get to color in. Each star is worth 10. We're going to color in five stars. This booklet is from Kim over at Star Budgets. I will have her link down below. And I'm sorry, you guys, that when I was uploading some of my videos for last week, I know I've been traveling to for one more. Um, I couldn't tag. Like, I don't know if it's because my internet was crappy of where we were at or the Airbnb or whatever. But I am so sorry, you guys, that I couldn't tag. Normally, I'll have their shops li listed down below, but I like to tag their YouTube channel. That way you can go, you guys can go and watch them and support them that way as well. But for some reason, I was not able to tag everybody and I felt bad because I was able to tag some people, but not all. So just to let you guys know, it was, <laughs> I tried, I tried and I'm so sorry. All right. So this one is from Tanya's Budget and Chaotic Life. This is the fairy one. We're going to do some of these. So we got five. And I keep forgetting my my desk vacuum. I need to charge it. <laughs> but it's fine, right? It's fine. Everything's fine. All right. So let's open this bad boy up. We're going to start with the big one. We do have bucks. I did keep them separate. Boom. Look at that. Annabelle didn't get any. I feel so bad. Yeah. No. So we're going to skip Miss Annabelle, who's here with me as per usual. All right, we're gonna start with me. I got some bucks. I'm excited about that because normally I don't get any. But while we were in Iowa, we stopped by the bank <laughs> because I like to see where I can get different letters, right? In different states. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Yes. So yeah, I got six. I'm super excited. I know that was messy. Don't judge me. Sippy sip. All right. So six going in. Next up, Caroline did get some bucks we're just gonna zoom out a little bit that way I want to make sure you guys can see everything My, the disaster that is me she only has three one two three I think we're just gonna continue with this yellow and these challenges are from Donna power by creativity and Miss Donna does such a great job when she colors hers in way better than me and she also does it by color so like those would have been black that would have been red 
and so forth. But you know what? We can't, I can't be Miss Donna. <laughs> I could try. That would be goals. All right. I was about to color without counting. That won't, that wouldn't make any sense. Let's see. Vince didn't get as many as he normally does. So, I could have sworn I had another H. That's weird. Huh. All right. G bucks. We have three. So, how was your guys' weekend? I hope you guys had a good one. I hope you guys are starting out your week good as well. We start back to work tomorrow, which is fine. Last week we only worked two days, so I am happy to go back to work. <laughs> I need to make that money, you guys. I'm gonna make sure. I could have sworn I had another H, but I guess I didn't. Okay, so. Um, this is new. I don't know if I showed you guys last time. I can't remember, but, um, I did get H for Hades. He does, she does have one for, um, Hercules, but I mean, I love Hades. <laughs> and then it goes into my home improvements is for the ages. So it's just extra money to help towards fund fixing up the tiny home. Not that it needs fixing up, but you know, painting and all that to cosmetic stuff. All right, Miss Luna has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. My kitty cat has eight, which is awesome. Because it's basically for her and Luna, or her and Annabelle. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so that's going in all right next up birthdays birthdays all right i do have a list of all my savings challenges and how much i'm trying to put in for each one so celebrate for the birthdays which i guess would be my birthday because that's who's next <laughs> yours truly um it's gonna be five so we're gonna continue with the green so we have one two three four five perfect five's going in and i don't to be honest i don't know how much it's all gonna add up to but hopefully enough for me get a little something something oh <gasps> you guys I forgot to print out shut the box which is probably fine because apparently I didn't write it in my in my thing to save up for so coolo coolio all right so for Leo and the Sagittarius we're both getting 10 so Vince is first Mr. Leo was well, worth 10 Nothing. Well, the symbols are worth five each, so that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do another symbol and another one. Cool. So 10's going in his envelope. And these just fund our own personal stuff. So like if he wanted to get a game or a comic book or whatever he wants, he can do that. So, Crystals are five. Ooh, let's do let's do a crystal. Yes. All right, here's my ten. Let's do a crystal. Are each? Or is it the whole thing? I want to say it's the whole thing. Look at that messy coloring. Oh my gosh. Guys, I need help. These are so chunky monkeys that. I might have to sharpen it. It's a little messy. It's a lot messy. But hey, it's colored. It's colored. All right, summer. Doesn't need 20, so hopefully we can scratch off something less than 20. Oh, you guys, I didn't even tell you who that's from. These are from Mystic Budgets. 
the celebrate one was from two sister bees sorry this is from tanya's budget and chaotic life i am so bad at that i feel like i need a reminder or something like in front of me all right 15 we're gonna stop there because i only designated 20 so 15 going into summer we should have 450 dollars at the end of this this is also from tanya excuse me i like birth did Ooh, five we we're supposed to designate 15. should i stop Ooh, the nerves the nerves so what if i get a 20. like i just did of course of course you know all right so 25 is going in that's okay i have another 50. i should probably break up some i think we could do it with this one 20 40 50. Can't look at that. Now we have 20s. Ha 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 ha. 50 going in. All right. Cool. Normally, like, I want to try to wait so I could do a bill exchange because those are so much fun. I never end up doing it because I always do something like that where I'm just like, oh, I have a big bill. Let's get rid of it. All right. Ms. Donna. Challenge. I did not put her in, but we are going to go ahead and do it. So, I need to add her on here. Let's add her. Let's get rid of Shut the Box. We'll take a break from Shut the Box and let's do this. So, I'll write Donna on here. So, then I know. Okay. So, Miss Donna, let's save some money. Let's do $2. It's like we're working our way up, right? Because we did a dollar, and now we're doing two dollars. Two down make you holla. This is a freebie, so um, if I'm able to tag her YouTube channel down below, make sure you go check her out. But if not, you just type in Donna Power by Creativity. She'll pop up, and this is a freebie on her YouTube channel. Ah! Next is Magical Mayhem. From hands and bands miss alicia okay so we're gonna roll the dice because that's how i roll five one two three four five it's a five dollar larry five dollar make you holla we're almost done with this you guys how much did i save for this one as i roll again I'm not even looking 15 okay cool so one two So we're at six. Let's keep going. Two. One, two, right? Another dollar. So we're at seven. Three. One, two, three. <laughs> I got rid of all of them. So we're gonna stop, maybe, wait, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 12, 13. Yeah, let's, okay, let's just, we're just gonna pick one. Cause I'm not chancing it with a dice. I don't trust the dice. So, sorry dice, we cheated. So we're gonna put 13 in. 10, 11, 12, 13. How close are we? Oh my gosh, you guys. We just need, what, 10, 20 30 more dollars so definitely we'll finish this by the end of this month for sure yes super exciting okay so next one i skipped the wedding one and have what's up with me skipping challenges wedding because i have the ramen yeah so weird i don't know we'll just put five in oh this is for my sister's wedding. We got to save up money because I know I'm going to have to get a dress. 
We're gonna have to fly back down home. All the good stuff. All right, next. Oh, and this is from, I don't even know. Did I write it on there? I know it's written down um, in the description down below because I did look it up, but I forgot to write it on there. But this cute ramen one is from Lisa Great For Me and ramen is getting $15. And we're gonna color in the ramen. All right. I was trying to go with the color scheme of this and I was actually doing a really good job until just now. So it is what it is. <laughs> But I love it. I love ramen and I love this challenge. And at the end, we'll have $375, which is a lot. I love it. All right. So for this one, it gets 20. I think I'm going to try to do what um, Madeline over at Madeline Budgets. I think she started off with the higher ones. And after she finished all the 20s, then she moved down to the 10s and all that stuff. So I'm going to try, you guys. When I can, I will. So there's a 20 going in. So cute. And then nothing for the 100 envelope challenge because we do that with the challenges that we completed. So, and we didn't complete any of the big ones today from the big book, I should say, but that's okay. We're gonna continue on to the smaller one, my A6, what little, what little? Okay, so mystery is gonna get 20. So let's see. We'll do this one, a woman's beauty. All right, calculator on, ready, let's go. Two, eight, seven. Mm, we'll stop there. So we got $17 going in. That's a good start. And we'll complete one mystery challenge at a time. That way I don't get too confused. And I get confused easily. So, there's that. All right, next up. The 101 is getting $25, or as close to 25 as we can. Let's start down here, because I like to be random. Two. That's 25. How <laughs> amazing is that? Oh my gosh. 9772. 25. Perfect. Oh my gosh. Right? 14 plus 9 plus 2. Yeah. I was just making sure I didn't like <laughs> mess up. That is awesome. All right, so the next one is the save $150. I can use, I budgeted $30, so let's see what we could do. And I'll talk about this. I, because I didn't mention it, this is from Star Budgets. This is her mystery monthly um, savings, like box, basically. So you can get it, you sign up on her website. I'll have everything linked down below and it's a monthly subscription. If you don't know what I'm talking about, you guys need to watch some of my videos because I know, especially my happy mail, because I just opened this one for August. We're at 17. One more, one more. <sighs> Perfect. <laughs> Whoop. Flung my pen at me. Again, we got exactly $30, perfect. I was trying to divide it up since I know how much money we're saving. I was trying to divide it up as an, into the weeks the best that I can, but not only, sometimes you can't do that, but I love how the denominations are low. It's one through 10, so we can get this done. All right, next is Purple Passion. I budgeted 20, because I feel like that's, well, 25 is the highest, so let's see. Ooh, 13. Perfect. We're going to stop there. So 10, 11, 12, 13. 
This is also from Kim over at Star Budgets. This is off of her Etsy. Oh, and this pen came with the monthly box as well. So it's not just challenges. You get envelopes, you can get a pen. She's very, very creative. All right, next is, I call it my steampunk. This is from Tanya, Budget and Chaotic Life. And this is the fairy dog challenge. And right now we're at 12 and I budgeted 20. So let's do one more. Oh, 14. Should I do one more? <laughs> all right, all right, all right. 24, I'm gonna put 25 in and take a dollar out. Oh, you guys, it's fine. All right, perfect. Should we count to see how much we have? We can save up to 168. I haven't been counting. One, two, three, four, five, sixty, one, two, sixty-two dollars. Normally I don't. Sometimes I count and sometimes I don't. I don't know. It depends, but I'm almost. Uh, we're getting there. Oh gosh, this one. You guys, this is from Budget by Number, and she's really good with this because some of them I don't even know. I thought I would be really good at this challenge, but no. All right, so our next one, no blank, no opinion. I don't know. No uterus, no opinion. <laughs> I feel like, would that be a Phoebe thing? I don't even know how to spell uterus. Jeez, Louise. I have one. Dang. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six dollars going into friends. I feel like that would be a Phoebe thing to say. All right. Shall we count to see how much we have? I don't think we have been because clearly it's not in order. But let's count. Because I'm curious. Or I haven't counted, that's probably why, because I don't know how much we're gonna save, but we're gonna do it anyways. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36. 36 dollars. That's not bad. I don't know, you guys. These are tough. These are tough, and I haven't watched it in forever. All right. Oh, does it say how much we'll save? Oh, a total of $100. That's cool. That's good to know. I didn't know that. No, I did. All right. Money girl. So we, I budgeted out $20. So let's see what we get. Uh, let's stop. Let's stop. All right. It's $18. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, okay. So we can save $120, and right now we are at 10, 1, 2, 3, 40, 41, 42, 43. We're at $43. Cool. We're moving right along. Unicorn is also budgeted for $20. This is one through five. Twenty-one. So twenty-one is going in. We're probably gonna finish this one next week because you only save forty-five with this challenge. So we have one, two, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one. Yeah, we will definitely have this finished up next week. That's exciting. All right. That might be our first challenge that we'll actually complete. Donations is getting 12. This is from Lisa Great From Me. This is a freebie. So you'll have to watch her on her YouTube channel to get it and print it out. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we're doing two weeks worth. Okay. 
And the goal of this is basically you're supposed to save a dollar a week whenever she started it. I don't remember when she actually started it, the, ch um, the challenge, but you save a dollar a week up until um, Thanksgiving and then you can, you'll have money to give to someone in need. So right now we're up to 10, 15, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4. Ooh, I saw an H. I'm gonna put that to the side and grab a dollar. All right, I have extra dollars on the side only because if I needed to break some bigger bucks, I do have extra ones. Just in case you're wondering why I didn't take from here, that's why. I'm gonna move the H over to the side because I will forget and use it. <laughs> but yeah, we're moving along. We should be, I'll have to watch her video um, and see where she's at. All right, Roses is getting $10. These are a dollar each. So one, two, three, four. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Ten's going in. We have ten, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Oh, <gasps> another H buck. We're switching it. <laughs> Probably because I haven't started doing my H bucks until like later. All right, I bought a new bag of Skittles. You guys be ever so proud of me. We're gonna. Make a little slit, shake them up. I haven't washed my hands. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna just pour hopefully one into, on top of my lid. All right. All right, I feel one. I got it. Eh. Watch it be purple. <gasps> Red, okay, cool. We're gonna move that to the side. And I need something to keep that closed. We're gonna have to get a baggie or something. Okay, so red, red, yes. My red from those markers isn't a true red. So we're just gonna use my permanent marker to color this one in. Red is $5, I will take it. I've been getting a lot of purples recently. So I am happy with that, so $5. All right, you guys, that's it. So I do have leftover money. However, what I'm doing now with my leftover money, if I have leftover money for my challenges, normally I go back and I try to fill them up. Um, we're going to Universal in November and I need to start saving for it. So here is my travel binder. And what we're gonna do, we're gonna take our extra money that we have, which is 10, 20, 30, Oh, a lot of extra money. Okay, let's see. 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, $51. And we'll do a video on stuffing that once we're done with all of my videos, if that makes any sense. So that is it for my savings challenges as far as coming out of the big book. I love my big book. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, please give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. I hope you guys have a great day or night whenever you guys are watching this. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!